after all, of course. That is completed. We're laying coordinates now. Okay. We're not going to... I'm not leaving you to away so that easily. You're going to pay for the lives you ruined. Commence attack. Target the flagship. You have to defeat Schultz, and Yamato has to has to fight it in this place. Okay, so part of this Oh, we've all you guys have already gone. Not in the best position to counterattack. All right. Okay, why do level up with seven? I'm moving these guys up to position. Alright, you're undamaged. You're undamaged. You're undamaged. So are you. So are you. So are you. So now basically what we need to be doing is advancing everyone forward to take out the take out these guys get the position to attack the flying ship. Very worked out pretty well. Okay. In the breast burn. So I have to target specifically. Schultz in the Chevalier. Destroyed that. And that's be tricky. And the catch is we also can't. Alright, so Gerald Torres' ship. Is this one. So we can't target him to get destroy him. If we destroy him, then we don't get the SR point. using that earlier. Ah, you can move the attack still. Alright, and you can't touch me at all. It won't crit, but it does soften you up more. Kose can't advance any further.
clear some of these guys out of the way of our, of our crew. If I move, I can only fire the bow torpedo. But uh, that said, that will be enough to finish you off. We will end the strife in our solar system before turning towards Iskandar. All you need to remember that Iskandar is the light at the end of this dark tunnel. Yes, sir. I motion to support my brother and his friends protected life of the Yamato's creation. We'll keep the Yamato alive and save the Earth from total destruction. Boom, and you are hit, and you are done. Now I got some armor! Hey! I can upgrade some of the other ships that got freaking beat up. Alright. So, you're going to go after Kincaid. Drop that because you're making it a little less squishy. I was going to use that. Attack her first and one hit KO. Off and up. And... Little damage. You're down, but you're softened up. And level up! Mass direction tight. I... reason why I really boost the evasion for the F-91 is so it get beats up. So when it gets beat up on like this, it has a bit more chance of protecting itself. Here we go. Now they start moving forward to attack the Yamato. Alright. I don't want you to destroy that ship. And you're definitely going to hit me. Boom. So, I will just use that on for C on myself. And just no sell your crap. Don't give an inch. But stop the Terran ship and save Commander Schultz. They're just fighting, so their flesh is safe. I know it. Now I know what it feels like to be on the other side. Nothing! You got nothing and you like it. Alright, now move you forward. Oh, wait. Multi action. Forward to here. I can then kill you. Particle cannon. And then I get to do this again. start softening up these guys so we can move the squad further forward.
Ooh. Alright, so I actually do the same thing. Multi action with Kincade. Probably my crit chance, but not enough. Alright, you also have enough points for the direct action. Not enough to finish you off. Rush saver finish. All right, but the that one. Oh, it does. Oh, it was enough. The assist. The assist works for this purpose. Excellent. to finish you off the Vulcan Cannon. Level up to seven. Let's walk in there. Beams up on a cap ship. Do that. Oops. That was like an already an effect on me. Sure, I hit. Kill, but you miss, and I level up. Actually, I can really just move, start moving the thick of things. Not here about using commands here because that's enough to finish you off. And now we've just, now we've just cleared your flank. You're not the person I'm worried about, so I'm absolutely not showing the demo for this one because it's a really long one and it got me copyright flag the last time. Well, I can't do that one again. Let's drop the damage that I'll take, at least.
pings out the barrier. Softens you up. Cosmo Falcon Squadron. Barrier. Fritz. I'm not even trying to touch it. All right. First, first blood on the Chevalier! Actually... For, actually, no, first. You get first blood on the Chevalier, because I'll make sure I need to do that in order to get the... Analyze. The Chevalier to soften you up. And then fire. Target the enemy flagship. All units take aim. Why? Why do these Terrans not give up after all the damage they've suffered? Zalsians will die before surrendering. These Terrans have. Oh. Excuse me. Zalsians will die before surrendering. Do these Terrans have the same determination? Boom. First tap. Things off the barrier. And then. Evasion, so you can't hit with your counter attack. All right, I can't put close enough to attack them. But I need to build up my meter. So I can kill you just fine. Oh, not quite. Better idea. Micro missiles. New stop up, guys, and the new flagship. You're gone. And you're softened up. Shop the cap ship. Got you. Hey, you can't even touch yet to them. Oh, your you, your threat range. Ow. 
Oh, nope. Oh, well. I'm almost got you finished off. Alright, you can... You're fine, and also Lottie may come for the save. The barrier... And smokes you. up. I'm not going to touch you at all. Actually, if I evade... Okay, there is a chance that you miss if I pull a day. That's not actually going to help you. Oops, nope. That's what I wanted to, not what I wanted to do. I think we use the beam saber after attacking, so let's do boost dash. Oh, the wrong one. So you use direct attack ability. Move me forward. And hit you with a breast burn. Your 100% hit chance, and a hope that I do enough damage to finish you off. Yes! All right. SR point obtained. No, the Chevalier isn't going to make it. I won't let that happen. The enemy ship is headed straight for us. All units fire at will. Stop that ship. All units fire. Commander Schultz, the fate of all Zalsons rest with you now. Yell Tora! All speed ahead. Destroy the Yamato. I won't let it I will not let any of your sacrifices be in vain, Yarl Tora. I swear it. And he's gone. Enemy flagship is withdrawing and preparing to war. Enemy flagship is withdrawing and preparing to war. I see. Commander gave his life to the flagship and escape. Just like Mamoru Kodai. Our enemy is more like us than we expected. Commander? The Yamlin Pluto base is finished. Earth need no longer fear the flag of the planet bombs. We did it, Kodai! Yes. Yeah, we did. We did it, Mamoru. With their main base here destroyed, it's safe to say we won't be seeing any more Gambolons in this solar system. Now we can focus on getting now we can focus on getting to Iskandar. It's 160 it's 168 light years one way, which means it's a 336 light year round trip. And the Gambolons won't get in our way again, judging by the way they tucked tail and ran. Dad, Mom, you, now no one has to worry about the sky falling anymore. From now on, I'm, not, I'm going to fight for Earth, not for revenge. As part of the Yamato, I'll make sure that Earth's future is brighter than its past. Meanwhile, Plato has fallen? I did not dream it, did I hiss? The Terran sick had ship had sunk? No, sir, I was under that impression too. Schultz has abandoned the base and retreated from the front lines? Y yes, sir. Gamblin does not know the meaning of retreat. There is victory, and there is death. There is nothing else. Sir! Perils. Uh... Dispatch truth to the galaxy for some entertainment, but it's proving to be widely disappointing. And two episode, two DLC scenarios unlocked! And those will wait until next week. So next time... We will do the, do we'll do the two DLC missions.
Thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the show, please like and subscribe. And also consider backing my Patreon. Patreon backers get episodes up to one week early of this show and any future Let's Plays. Also, please consider backing my coffee. Uh, toss me a few bucks, also helps support the show, and it's not a monthly obligation or anything like that.